Good day. Today, we will talk about scientific notation. So, when we say scientific notation, it is a convenient and widely used method of expressing large and small numbers. Scientific notation is useful because it allows us to easily write and make calculation with extremely small and extremely large numbers. So, it is any quantity that can be expressed in the form of n times 10 raised to n, where the capital N here is any number between 1 and 10, and n is the appropriate power of 10. So, in converting very large or very small numbers in scientific notation, so let's, let me give you an example. So, for example, so, express the following in scientific notation. For example, in physics, speed of light is very uh, familiar term. So, the value or the appro approximate, approximately, the value of, rather, uh, the value of speed of light is approximately 300 million meter per second. So, how can we write this 300 million meter per second into a scientific notation. So, uh, writing 300 million is a very tedious way. So, that's why we use, we will be using uh, scientific notation. So, or we will going to change it into scientific notation. So, for example, uh, the, the speed of light is 300 million meter per per second. So first, if the given value or the given values are in whole number, always remember that the decimal point of the any whole number is always on the uh, most right. Okay, so most right of the number. So therefore, and first thing we need to do is to locate the decimal point. Okay? And since we will we will be moving it to the left okay and when we move the de decimal point to the left the exponent will be positive okay for example uh, we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so in that case uh Eight movement. So therefore, we have three. We have uh, three times ten raised to positive eight. Positive eight because we move the decimal point eight uh, places to the left. So in this case, uh, why do we move the decimal point to the left? Because the number is very large. Uh, so, we need to move it to the left to reach the capital N or the N wherein, according to our definition, it is the uh, any number with, between 1 to 10. So, the value of N here must be uh, between 1 to 10 only. So, we need to, and 11 and above is not applicable. So, in this case, since we need to reach the value 10, so we move it to uh, 8 places to the left so always remember that if you move the decimal point to the left okay, the exponent will be positive so we have here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 so therefore the value of the speed of light in scientific notation is 3 times 10 raised to 8 meter per second. So, that is the value. Okay? So, we we don't need to exceed the movement because 0 0.1, when, once we exceed it, it, the value will become, the N, the capital N will become a 0 0.3 wherein it is not uh, on the range of 1 to 10. Okay, or it is not between the range of 1 to 10. Okay, so let's proceed to another example. 
So, let's have another example which in this case, uh, mass of a strand here is approximately 0 0.0000062 kilograms. So, how do we write very small? In this case, the value is very small. So, how do we write very small numbers in scientific notation? So, our first rule is to find the decimal point. So, in, which, in, which is in this case, it is located here. So, since it is very small number, we move it to the right. We're in, we're in uh, we need to reach the uh, capital N which is uh, it needs to be on the range between 1 to 10 so we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 so why do we stop on, the, on 7 movement because once we exceed another movement it becomes 62 where in 62 is not on the range of between 1 to 10 1 to 10 so therefore how many movement do we move how m or uh, we take so we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so therefore the value in scientific notation is 6.2 times 10 raised to okay negative 8 okay rather 7 negative 7 kilograms so we have uh, let let us check if it's really 7 movement 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so why negative 7 because uh, we move it to the right and negative exponent indicates a uh, smaller value okay so we are done with a very large number and the, uh, a small number so let's have another uh, example which is in this case it is the mass of the electron okay so very small uh, very small value so in this case uh, the value of mass of electron is 0 0.00000 so on uh, 9.11 kilogram so how do we write it on uh, scientific notation or how do we write it in scientific notation so let's have an exa uh, let's do this example so first locate the decimal point Okay, indicate whether it is very large or very small number. So, in this case, it is very small number. So, we will do the movement. So, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Okay? So, it will become 9.11 times 10 raised to negative 31 kilogram. Okay? So, we need to uh, include the point ele the 11 num number because it is non-zero digit. And if we, if the value has all also different non-zero digit, uh, we need to round it off into decimal places or whatever places it needs to be rounded off. So, in this case, uh, let's stick to the two decimal place. Uh, uh, let's round, off, round it off into the two decimal place. So, the value here is 9.11 times 10 raised to negative 31 uh, kilogram. So, thank you.